excited because I'm here with Kayla from Purple Stars 02 and we're going to open a mystery box each. I'm yes. going to open one and she's going to open one and we are going to compare what we get. So this is unicorn themed. It is humongous, you guys. This has been sitting at my house for a couple days now and the temptation to not open it is so real, I cannot even tell you. Yeah, so I do mystery boxes in my shop. I get like, I do limited edition ones. And so I'll do two, maybe three a month. It depends. Sometimes mm -hmm. I have more, sometimes I have less but I just plan them ahead and I really put a lot of love into them and I pick out exactly what I want and I pick a special theme every time. Mm -hmm. So like right now we have unicorn mystery, yes. we have a winter mystery, which is really Whoa. fun. And we have a black and white mystery. And so I just, it, they cycle through and they change all the time. Probably and depending on season and yeah. all that. Yeah, and that's so cool. It's exciting. Ah. So you're gonna open the mystery package from me, the unicorn themed one. And okay. I just got like a generic generic mystery box from like Amazon and mm -hmm. you can kind of get anywhere. So they're oh, really right. similar. This is a little more expensive. This was $25 yes. and the unicorn one's 20. And so we're gonna kind of compare them and see. Yeah, cause they're pretty similar in price, which would be interesting yeah. to see the variation. Okay. I'm excited. Okay, can I start? Yes. Okay, thanks. I'm just really <laughs> eager right now. Have to dig in. Wow. Okay, so she has the unicorn mystery package, but I also added one extra surprise that's not a part of the mystery package. It's just something Yay. special for her. I can't wait. Okay, hang on, I'm gonna get this one more piece of tape. All right, three, two, one. Let's see. No. You're gonna see the, the extra thing first. So take that out, that's the extra. This is not the mystery package, but I hope she loves this. Oh, what? this is bigger than me. Girl. It's three feet long. It's a unicorn uh -huh. that I just added to my shop. Guys, this is insane. And fun fact, this is officially the biggest puppet I have in my collection. That makes me Ever. Happy. Times 10. Literally. <laughs> it's humongous. It can't even like fit in the whole screen. Of the no. Camera. The other day I was live and somebody said, what is your dream fidget that you'd love to for this? I literally said a giant puppet because I don't have one yet. I feel like Santa so Claus right you. now. <laughs> I am in love. Wow. Yeah, guys. Amazing. I'm gonna, we're going to put it right here. It's now... Uh, center of the table. It is three it's feet. Huge. It's one of the biggest poppets in the world. I believe it. I mean, then we have to flip it. Yes. Then we have to pop it. You know, it'd be okay. fun. It'd be fun if you like pop down one row and then you see if you get more bubbles like you meet in the Ooh. middle. Does that make sense? Yeah. You yeah, should try that. That'd be fun. It's like a TikTok idea. Oh yeah. Girl, well, thank you so much. And it even has a little pop it bubble in the eye. In the eye. Yes, they didn't miss that golden opportunity to do that. Just I love all it. the little <laughs> Exactly. Okay, so now we're gonna see. Okay, so now we're getting yeah. to the mystery packet. Yes. That was just a little something something for you. See what magic awaits us. Whoa! Wait, so is this it? Yeah. Like, okay, gotcha. They come in like a little plastic bag, and this everything in the bag is what comes in the mystery packet. It's, the colors yeah. vary, so like when you get yours, there'll be little variations. This is- You're not gonna get the same color. This, <gasps> this is literally like magical looking. Okay, so we're gonna start with this. Oh my God. <gasps> yeah, it's one of the bubble blowing things. She, Guys! This is my new biggest obsession. And I don't say that lightly. Like, honestly, this is adorable. It's my new favorite one. Like, it's a unicorn blow bubble pet. Talk about magic. Oh, can I get Carl and La and yes. Pinky and- Yes, save them <laughs> from their dark, dark box. <laughs> the gang's all here. Oh so if you watch the video that we made on her channel, she unboxed another mystery package yes. from me. <laughs> and of course. it had three blow bubble pets. Yes, they're the we were having like an argument, not an argument, but like- A debate? A debate. Yeah. 
a good natured discussion mm -hmm. on if these were like dinosaurs or chickens or birds or whatever. She strongly believes they're not birds. They're definitely not birds. I know but, birds. Yeah, so so many blow bubble pets. So I had to keep it a secret because I knew that I had a unicorn blow bubble pet in this package, but I didn't say anything because I wanted it to be a surprise. Well, just saying, I would buy the mystery package just for this alone. I'd pay 20 bucks for this. I'm serious. So its name is Sparkles. It's just meant to be. Yep. Okay. Didn't even have to think about it. It's just Sparkles. Whoa! I've never seen this before. I tried to put really unique fidgets in the mystery package. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is the coolest thing. So it's a pink Orbeez unicorn stress ball. Wow. And this they'll come in different cool. colors. So you might get a purple or a blue or white, clear. Well, I'm so happy about pink. pink. That's my favorite color. Thank you. I love it. Okay. Next up. Whoa. Look at this, you guys. I have never seen a unicorn poppet that looks like this. I've seen the ones that kind of have like this yes. general shape. Does that make sense? Yes. You know? The head ones are like the most... Common, yeah, although common. when they're three feet, they're not common. Well, yeah. most of them are like poppets that are that size mm -hmm. that have this design. It's just in different colors. In different so, colors. I've never seen something that looks quite like this. So this is definitely unique, which I've said this so many times, but I'll say it again. I'm a sucker for unique fidgets. Like they are my favorite things. So thank you so much. I love that. And those also come in like tons of colors. Yes. They're really pretty. And then, oh, of course, unicorn noodles, duh, had to have these. So they're pink and purple. Oh, it's so cute. We just did a color versus color fidget shopping challenge on our channels. And for my channel, we did um, pink and purple. So, oh, that's so appropriate for Fun today. Fact, purple is my favorite color and pink is Kayla's. And so yes. we got to look for our favorite colors. That's why we did it that way. It was <laughs> meant to be. That is so fun. You want one? It's so hard for me to watch other people play with or unbox fidgets. <laughs> Sorry, and you have to like, give me, give me, give no, me. no, that's why I was saying, here, help yourself. It's like, it's like when you have an itch and you can't scratch it. That's the same I way I feel. Too. I like how it has like the tiny little hole and so yeah. you can connect them and like make like a bracelet. That's so fun. Oh you my God, play I love with it. The little spikies. And I don't think I have these colors. I have like oh. yellow and a different shade of pink, but I don't have these ones. Oh. So very happy to add those to my collection. But then, okay, so the grand finale. Whoa, this really is the grand finale, you guys. Because look, this is adorable. It's a little unicorn sitting on a moon and this is a dimple, mm -hmm. okay? So, oh my goodness. And it has a little keychain too, we love that. <gasps> look, the little pink and purple again. And have you ever seen that dimple? Nope. Nope. And oh, she goes just fit shopping that. all the time. Like four times a week. So, <laughs> yeah. If she hasn't seen that, that means it's very unique. It's very unique. And I work very it. hard to make unique mystery packages. Well, and I think that's yes. something that makes mine special. Absolutely. A plus. Yay! I loved this. It was so much fun. Now I'm actually, I want to go look at all your other mystery packages. Oh. Now. Like this is something that I'm into it. Okay. Honestly, I love the idea of it. Let me know in the comments. Every time I get a new mystery package, should I send it to Kayla to unbox? <laughs> <laughs> me. Okay, it's my turn. I can't wait to open the box and see what we get. Yay! Okay, it says there's 21 fidget toys. 21. Okay. That's a lot. It is a lot. Comes in like this bag. It's like a yes. Okay. So like, I've never opened one of these. Never. No, I never have. Oh should my god. I op take one at a time. Or should I dump? Hmm. Let's take one at a time. Okay. It'll be First fun. thing, a snapper. Blue snapper. I love snappers. Okay. Oh, it doesn't work very well. Uh, sometimes it does, and sometimes it doesn't. It works when it feels like. <laughs> Just like me. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a little snapper in blue. Some mini noodles. Ooh. Two mini noodles, and they're so cute and tiny. Yes. Okay. Hey! A, a unicorn and pink! How about that? Coincidence. That is, yeah. Okay. Oh, this is one of the ones that stick to the ceiling. Like a globble kind of? I think this is a globble. Oh, it's like an off-brand globble. Okay. I think it is. Oh, yeah. 
They're more airy though. Yes, they're super airy. Yeah. But they're a little sticky and they're supposed to connect with your wall. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> yeah, you got that wall. <laughs> so we got one globby. I've never seen just like one globby though. I'm I wonder sure if there's more the hiding in there. I feel like there's probably more. Oh, let's see. Okay. That's like Halloween vibes. Yeah, it's green and orange and black. It's giving very like Halloween. For sure. Okay. I like that color combo. I don't have that color combo, so no. I'm like, okay. Fun. Cute. Little tangle. Okay. A wacky track. Watermelon it's colors. Pink and yes. Yeah. I like to connect them like this. Mm -hmm. And uh, I love that sound. Yes. It's a very, it's like that little click. Mm -hmm. It's I satisfying. It. it satisfies my soul. I just got like a whole bunch, well not recently, like in the last few months, like a whole bunch of new color schemes in for Ooh. wacky tracks. Because I think that's kind of fun. Because I was used to like the same old, same old. There's mm -hmm. like blue, green, pink, orange. And the orange, yeah. And they were all like all... Just those, repetitive. Yeah, they're yes. either pink and blue or orange and blue or mm -hmm. and so I was just kind of like I love wacky tracks but it's over those colors right no I so totally relate we made like some really fun color combinations like pink and blue and I mean there's a whole bunch there's even like a gray like, there's like a navy there's a white oh wow yeah. that's so, super fun like that. yeah okay Fun fact about me that you might know. You don't I'm like this. I don't like I knew that dinner. about you. <laughs> I always say that so if you've watched like any of my videos you know that but it's a dimple and I do love dimples. But like, you know, I don't love like the, it's too much. Like my brain's like, no, my eyes are like, no. I yeah. don't like that. That's interesting. Remember when fidget spinners were like a trend yes. in itself a couple of years ago yes. in like 2017? Yeah, it was just fidget spinners without the dimple pops. Yes, just the actual yeah. like, metal fidget spinner and like a bunch of different designs. They were big for like one summer. Yeah, not like, very long. No. I didn't, I mean, I didn't care if like my students used them because I was in the classroom as a math teacher. I didn't yeah. care if my students used them, but like for myself, not into it. Mm -hmm. I was like, nothing. Next. Okay. <gasps> I love DNA balls. I do too. So I love all kinds of DNA balls, honestly. This one's a little bit more on the airy side. I really like the ones that have like a ton in there. They're so satisfying. Yes. I don't, like for me, like squeezing this like does nothing for me. I'm like, meh. You know what? I like meh. it. I just said, yes. it reminds me of a gumball machine. That's why that I like cute. it. It just the makes me happy. The look of it is cute, but like for me, like squeezing it, I'm just like, meh. Yeah. But the ones that are full, like chock full of the little balls. Yes. I have a light up one. It is literally my favorite thing. I ever. love those ones. So, so for DNA balls, I feel like they're not all created equal. No, they're definitely not. Each one no. is a little bit different. That one would be, I don't really like the airy ones personally. Personally, yeah. Mini <laughs> Rubik's Cube. Yeah. It's a no for me. Yeah, I've never, <laughs> I've never solved a Rubik's Cube in my life. I just don't have the patience to do it. Like, I've actually never even tried. This is more my like, okay, like if we're gonna do like a little puzzle, puzzle yeah. like Ruiz Cube, nah, but puzzle no, ball, no. yes. Can you please show me what you're supposed to do with those? Cause legit, I have no idea. Okay, so the puzzle balls have colors. So see how this is like pink? Yeah. And then there's a pink ball. Mm -hmm. I have to get the pink ball into the matching <gasps> spot. Wait, and now there's a purple spot, so I need to get this purple, but that's going to be very challenging. But like the challenging my brain likes, like this kind of challenging is like no, 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 no. no. But this is like okay, let me play this for a minute. Let yeah. me see. So I just am going to like kind of move the balls around. I never knew that and ever. Watch. I'm going to do it. Okay, this is Hang so on. cool. Two hours later. Two and a half hours later. I did it! <laughs> so yeah, purple into the purple. And so so far I've got pink and purple. And then I just keep doing that until I get the colorful balls in the right matching circle. Genuinely mind blown. I never knew that. I would literally just put my finger in there and be like, oh, so <laughs> fun. I'm not kidding. <laughs> and then you can use them over and over again. So say I was on a road trip and I did that, okay? And I'm hanging yeah. out and I got, I'm like, mom, I got them all. Yeah. Well, now I can I can basically like scramble them again Ooh. and play again. So it's like something you can play over and over and over again. And that's fun never fun. ends. Yes. I love that. Okay. Okay. Cool. So that's a puzzle ball. Okay. Come on. What are we to do with that? These are just like 
like filler so they can be like 21 fidgets in the yes. box and then they put things like this and it's like no stop no thank you yeah that's just let me see i mean like if you have a bunch of them they don't even connect. I have these ones. I think they call them urchin tumblers. They're like yeah, sticky. Yeah, those are different. And those are the ones yeah. that they're like, don't get in your hair. Because yes. there's like people who get them in their hair and it's like a mess. That's not these. These yeah. are not like that. They're not sticky. You mm -hmm. don't have to worry about getting them into your hair or anything. Okay, so then we got this little like. It's a puzzle ball or a puzzle cube. It's like a puzzle. See, mm -hmm. a lot of this stuff is things that I would give as a free extra. Like, yes. I wouldn't, like, sell these as a fidget. I would throw them in your package as, like, a free extra. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. So I had, I did this before where many Rubik's Cubes were a free extra that I did for, like, two months. And then uh -huh. I said, so, like, that's kind of how I would handle that. Like, I wouldn't, like, I don't know. It's not it's something you amazing. open and you're like, yes. <gasps> Yes. Amazing. For me, at least. It's almost kind of like a vending machine toy, if that makes yeah. sense. Like something you get from like a quarter machine. Yeah. So. so. Okay. Mesh and marble. These are not the most glamorous fidget, but they're a good fidget. Yeah, absolutely. <clears throat> so I'm a, I'm a mesh and marble stan. Okay. I'm like lukewarm about it. You know, I don't hate it. I don't love it. It's just like. Boink, 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 boink. <laughs> okay. Theme pod keychain. Yes. These are cute. Look, look They're very cute. Oh, back. I hope it has a face. Sometimes they don't have faces. Okay. They don't have faces? Sometimes. Oh my gosh. That would Feet. be a defective one. Okay, hang on. Let me get <laughs> really close. I'm okay. going to little face. Fun fact, only the middle ones have faces. Did you know that? Yes. Okay. I didn't know that. So only the middle ones have faces, and the middle one always pops out. But the side ones, sometimes they pop out, but not always. They're it's the not like dancing. as, yeah. Yeah, so he's the main character. This is like main character. Main character energy. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Super fun. Okay. I used to, when I first started in my store, because um, when you buy a lot, sometimes you get defective ones. So like their face might be like printed weird. Oh, or, yeah. Or that, like something weird. Right. So I would give my defective bean pods, like with the weird faces or whatever, mm -hmm. as freebies. And my oh, okay. they loved that. My followers loved that when I did that. It was so cute. It was like a whole Yeah, because you never know what face you're going to get. Because <laughs> it was the free extra. Well, yeah, I would, yeah. I would go through all of them and take out all my defective bean mm -hmm. pods, and then I would put them as a free extra and it was like a thing for a while. So I like that. While we were talking about that, I pulled out another mesh and marble. So we got two. Oh, two. So All right. We got, okay, this is another one. No, it's just, no. It just shouldn't be in there. These, it's it's like a, another, it's like on long lines of like these things. But can I just say, once you take that apart, there's, there's no together. putting it back together. Listen, I taught math, I taught gifted, advanced. I would have my genius students, like literally like the, cream of the crop and I'm like fig we bought like a package of these before yeah. and like those brain those plastic brain teaser ones yeah and they literally like the smartest kids like they're gonna be like roll the nation one day yeah. and like they can put them together I'm like these are like no you can't no. even put it back together yeah okay this is cute though look at this oh you know what you, you like um here let me show you okay I think these are fun oh so it's like a spiral I don't know what the heck to call Spiral it. Spiral graph? But no, it's it's that. kind of fun. I I have no idea. <laughs> Your guess is better than mine. I don't know what that's called. But it's neat. It like is. I like the colors. Yeah. I like, I like the colors that's most fun. of all. That's very cute. Fun. Yes. Okay. There's still more. There yeah. is more. I'm saving the best for last. Okay. okay. I got an infinity cube. The classic black infinity <clears throat> cube. Gotta got have it. it. Yes, but have you have? Do you have a few infinity cubes? I have like seven. Yeah. Okay. Have you seen like a? Di have you seen like a difference in quality? Like these is like the chintzy like plasticky type. Film. I have ones that are like heavier. If that makes sense. Like the blocks, they just literally feel heavier. This one's more light and airy. Yeah. I guess that's the main difference that I feel with them. Yeah. Out of the yeah. ones that I have. Okay. I have a few different types like at home. And the cutest one, it's like that type of material. And I'm like, yeah. it's so pretty. Like the, the, it's like a pastel, like 
pink and teal. Ooh. But I don't like how these ones go. I like the metal ones. So I, like I don't have a metal one. I don't okay. have a metal one. I'll send you one so you can compare. It's hooking me up with all the good fidgets, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> because once you've filled a metal one and you can compare it to like the plastic one, there's like no going back. Either. At least for me. But we all like different things. That's yeah. the cool thing about fidgets. Like right. we all like enjoy different sensations. Yeah. Personally for me, I really like the heftier, like metal A little bit ones heavier. And yeah. They really can navigate. Actually, I think I have one of them. Now that I'm really thinking about it, I think I have one metal one. So I know what you mean. Yeah, that's my favorite thing about fidgets too, because there's so many different variations, like colors and textures, and it's just so much fun. And like, they were, it's like come out with new things yes. all the time. So it's like you can always add to your collection. It's, it's addictive. So, oh my gosh. It really is. It's so fun. Okay, the grand finale. Dun, dun, dun. A tie-dye oh, heart puppet. I don't have that one. I got a bunch of rainbow ones. I did a bunch of these unboxings the other day. Oh. I got just pretty much all rainbow ones. So, so it's tie-dye blue yeah. and green and white, and that's pretty. That, that is very it. pretty. I like it, too. Okay, this one's pretty decent because the bubbles go down easy. Okay, let's you know? flip it That over. was the bad side. So. Yes, there we go. All right. I like it. I like it too. That was a good one. Yay! Okay, we laid everything out. So this was everything that I got in my box of 21 mystery fidgets. And this is everything in the unicorn mystery package. There's definitely like a lot. Like yes. there was a lot of things here mm -hmm. and that was fun. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it was like at times it was exciting, but like sometimes it wasn't because like I'd be excited to like pull out like something like this right. or this. So I feel like all in all, like it wasn't like this incredible experience because I mm -hmm. feel like at times I was a little, not just, I don't know if disappointed was the word, but just- Underwhelmed? Like, underwhelmed. Underwhelmed. Like, oh, okay. Yes. Like, hmm. So I think like some of the things they added like as a filler to make 21 items, you know, yes. like, awesome. But then like half like, of it was uh, kind of like- Right, like after you're done opening it, would you really want to go back and play with those fidgets? Yeah. Does that make sense? That's a great way to put it. Like it's fun, the suspense of it is fun, but then after the matter, it's like, ooh, but am I ever really going to go back yeah. to the item and actually have fun fidgeting with it? Yeah, because over a quarter of the items are things that like, I wouldn't even put in my fidget box. Like right. I wouldn't even save these. Right. So like a quarter of it was just kind of like, mm. Exactly. So, and again, I say, I really just love the uniqueness of the unicorn mystery package because I have literally never seen these things in stores before, especially <laughs> this. <laughs> like, I would gravitate towards this over a lot of those fidgets any day just because, again, this is not something you see every day. So it's really, really fun and unique. I'm also obsessed with this little Orbeez unicorn. I mean, I, again, I've never seen this before. I cannot get over it. It's just so fun, so much fun. Quality over quantity. Yeah, that's how I, because I think about what would I want, because yes. I am literally the person unboxing. Like, I love fidgets. I love adding to my collection, so I yeah. think if I were getting a mystery box, I open mystery packages on my channel all the time. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, if I were getting a mystery package, what? feelings would I want to feel. Yes. Does that make sense? Absolutely. And so That's I try to like feel. make it like everything in it is like worth it. Mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Right. So you're equally as excited as enticed about everything that you pull out of the package. But super fun. Thank you so much for unboxing mystery packages with Absolutely. me. Absolutely. I enjoyed it. So did I. If you like content like this, I do unboxing videos all the time. So please make sure to like this video, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to you later. Bye.